To many people, Facebook is simply a way to keep up with friends, family, colleagues, and acquaintances. But some see it as a way for Facebook to influence political opinion by pushing a liberal agenda. And now Facebook says it's taking extra steps to ensure the social media site remains objective by adding a section on, quote, political bias, unquote, to the class on managing bias that all Facebook executives and many employees have taken. Wall Street Journal reporters Deepa Sita Raman and Natalie Andrews write that the class focuses on identifying and neutralizing racial, age, gender, and other types of bias, according to Facebook Chief Operating Officer Sheryl Sandberg in a speech to the American Enterprise Institute Wednesday. The move follows a report last month from the tech blog Gizmodo that said curators of Facebook's trending topics feature suppress news about conservative events and sources. The feature is found to the right of Facebook's news feed on personal computers and can be found on the mobile app by tapping the search bar. While Facebook has said its own internal investigation revealed no evidence of political bias, the company has still revamped how the feature works to minimize the effect of individual political bias. The company also recently invited 16 top conservatives to its headquarters in Menlo Park, California to meet with Facebook CEO Mark Zuckerberg. Sandberg said Facebook wants to be a platform for an open exchange of ideas, noting the presidential nominee Donald Trump has more Facebook fans than Hillary Clinton and Bernie Sanders combined.